Hello guys, this is Argon Matrix here, welcoming you back to episode 13 of Super Mario RPG. And, uh, looks like this guy's still sleeping. Jeez, come on dude, you've been sleeping for like over five days now. It's time to get out of bed, buddy. Wake up. Wake up. Eh, screw you two. Let's just hear the sound again. Ah, uh, fun. Alright, so, uh, last time I believe we beat Bowyer. We beat him down. And, yeah. Um... Let me see, I think if you talk to him, then... Yeah, he's like, Gino, you came back! Mommy! See, Mom? This is, this is the Gino I was talking about. Yeah, see? He wasn't lying. He was telling the truth, lady. Aw, oh, forget it, Mom. Alright, Gino, let's play. Hi, I wish I could, but Mario and I must leave for now to find the missing star pieces. Star pieces? You mean like shooting stars? What for? Well, how can I explain this? We'll explain it through interpretive dance. And Mario's just gonna fly in the air and Mallow makes a wish. This is how this is how it used to be. Mallow makes a wish and it comes true. But now it's like Roaching Star. And Nothing happens. Oh my goodness. Uh Yep, ours is a world where wishes can't come true. Do you get it? Uh nope. <laughs> you lost me face palm. Well, let's just say that the th that things are... Well, let's just say that if things are th stay the way they are, your wishes will never come true. What? So you mean I'll never grow up? I won't ever be strong and cool like you? No one's wishes will come true unless the star pieces are found and star road repaired. Which is why I've chosen these two... Ch chosen to join these two in order to find the missing star pieces. So that's it. Well, Mario needs all the help he can get. Gino, I have a lot of dreams. Please go fix the Star Road and make sure they all come true. What the hell's Mario doing? What? Oh, it's because... Oh, I get it. Because he said... Yeah. Wow. Cool! Oh, wait. Wait a minute. Uh, yeah? Dude, what are you doing? This is yours, Gino. So take it along with you. Got a finger shot? Cool! Now I can shoot off his finger. Yeah, he's gonna give the enemies the finger. Hell yeah. Okay. Let's see, I don't think there's anything that I have left to do around here, per se. Uh, is there anything that I can buy in this shop? Of any use? Come on, give me something. Let's see. Uh, I already got all this stuff, so no. Anything new with you? Oh, I might as well buy some stuff here. How many mushrooms do I have? I have seven, that's fine. Honey syrup, seven. Pick-me-ups. I'll buy some more pick-me-ups. Oh, no more room. Gosh, darn it. Concern it. Things are finally back to normal. Thank you, Mario. You are welcome. Big boom over the mountains? Hmm, interesting. Yay! I'm wandering around up on top of the ledge. Yay! That was fun. Okay. Uh, let me see here. I think that's pretty much all I need to do in Rose Town. I don't know. I didn't do my research before this video. I need to start doing that more often. Because there's a lot of, like, hidden stuff in this game. Right, pipe Vault. Oh, this place. This place can get pretty annoying pretty fast. And I get I get addicted to a little something in this place. It's like a little mini game of sorts. Maybe you know what I'm talking about. Maybe you don't. Ow! That was horrible. Okay. So we got some classic Mario platforming here. Oh no! Except in Mario, that never happened. You just died when that happened. And you fall in the very realistic looking lava. Come on! Stop it. I believe you can actually fight these enemies. Or like these fireballs. And let's see. Yep, looks like it. Let's see. Oh, just one? Okay. It is a Sparky. I think that's what their official names in other games are too. Aw. Uh, I kinda actually forget the timing for Gino's finger shot there. But it looks more like an arm shot than a finger shot. He doesn't just shoot off one finger. Oh well. Hello Goomba. Okay, I guess we're fighting you. Two Goombas. Oh yeah. Well, I pretty much for like Gino's command there, I just hold the A button before he's about to fire, and it seems to work out. So I don't know. Maybe that's it. I am not too as as it gets later in the game, I'm gonna get less and less knowledgeable about certain things like action action commands and stuff. Uh, I could fight that guy if I want to, but I don't want to. So, nah. Oh crap. Oh, jeez. Whoa. Hello. Hello there, piranha plants. Yeah. 
And good enough they're called piranha clients, not something stupid like uh tulips. Jeez, these things are tough. Uh you know what? Let's just let's just run. Well couldn't run because Mal is so short and fat and screwed us. No. Oh you D bag. Okay. Come on. Stop attacking. No, what? Oh come on! Let me run away. I want to run away. Okay, run away. Thank you. And this scarecrow just hop off. That's funny. Okay, move it. Move it. Uh, I think I can probably go down some of these pipes, can't I? Maybe. Yeah, I can go down this one. Cool. Okay. Here's the mini game that I get addicted to because it's so hard and annoying. But yeah, I'll only show it once probably. How about it? Sure, why not? This is Goomba stomping, I believe. You know the rules? Uh. I'll just say nope, just so he explains it. Because he can probably explain it better than I can. I'll just be fumbling over my words if I try to. Thump a Goomba, get one point. Thump a Spiky, and lose one point. Thump a Gold Goomba, get three points. If you get more than 20 points, you get a prize. Want a recap? Nope, that was pretty much clear, concise, and to the point. Alright, and here we go. Let's start thumping Goombas. Oh, come on. Yeah, see, these guys can get, be a little tough to hit. I don't know. There's, there's one. Come, oh, cut, jeez. I get better at this game as it progresses usually, but apparently not today. <laughs> oh, gee, come on. These aren't golden goombas. They're like, they're more like brown goombas or like really dark brown or light. I don't know. They're, they're not gold. That, that's that much I know. Okay. Okay. Looks like we just got the pattern of this one guy over here. Oh, hello. Oh, I wanted that. Uh huh. This isn't working out too- Whoa! That was lucky. 15 points? That sucks. Okay, let's just talk to him. Looks like we got a tough road ahead. Good luck! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I once stayed there for like two hours just playing that game. I don't know. Actually, there's more to explore back there. What am I doing? Okay, let's see. Can I go down this pipe? Whoa! That was unexpected. Uh... We'll just deal with these guys, why not? Might want to cut away. We'll see. Ah, uh, la di da. Yeah, it takes a whole round of attacks from the entire crew to take these guys out. Jeez, no, come on. Not Gino. Fine. He's just gonna have to Gino beam you then. And ooh, scarecrow beam. Pierre beam. Hell yeah. Okay. Uh, you know I'm gonna use a fire orb on this guy just because I can. You'll die. <laughs> Burn in hell. Wow. That piranha plant would be more work to fire than that. Oh well. Okay. Go. Oh, you missed. Ha ha. You ran. You ran right up to me, bit me, and missed. How is that even possible? Okay. And flash. You die. Okay, come on, dude. See, now you're dead. Thank you. Oh, goodness. I'm actually surprised that that piranha plant came up from under me like that. Normally, piranha plants, in most games, they don't come out of their pipes while you're on top of them. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. That's a pipe that we can go down. And there's some coins here. Interesting. Yeah, I knew this was there. I wasn't, like, just really lucky or anything. And there's some neat little assorted treasures around along here, like two co two frog coins and a flower. Thank goodness I remember that. And you can slide under there like that if you want. Just to get that frog coin. I don't know. That was interesting. Yeah. This game this part of the like this pipe vault here, it really it's really just a big throwback to like basically the first Mario Brothers. Because this is a rather old game in itself, so I don't know. Uh-huh. So there's some chompers. We all hate those from, like, ROM hacks. Okay, no. Thank you. Why do prawn plants always seem to attack in large hordes? I don't know. Okay. Oh! This looks fun. Yay, flower! Okay. Yeah, run away. Go away, Goomba. Goombas don't follow you. What are you talking about? Ah, crap. 
Okay, give me that. No, give me that. No, okay, it's that <laughs> that block contains coins. That's not worth it. Not at all. Ah! Oh, by the way, guys, uh, I want to say happy Thanksgiving to the Canadians out there. It is yeah, today is Cana is Canadian Thanksgiving, I guess. Um, yeah, and I believe it's also Columbus Day in America. So, yay! Good job for Columbus, I guess. All right, so we'll overwrite this save in Yoster Isle. Hmm, interesting. Let's see. <gasps> Yoshi's! They're so happy! Oh my goodness. I can talk to them, but all they do is make Yoshi noises. Come on, where's the green Yoshi? Where's the oh, this guy looks cool. Cool. Alright. Mario, glad you finally came to made it to your Isle. Some of the home of the Mushroom Derby. Say, now that you're here, we could use your help. Please talk to a few of my pals here and... What? You can't understand them. I'll hop aboard and I'll be your interpreter. Alright. Yeah, we get to ride Yoshi. I wish we could do just the, the entire game. That would be fun. Just, like, ride around. Because he does go quite a bit faster, actually. What? Are you cracked? Racing is my life. I could run all day. Are you cracked? I've never heard that expression before. What are you looking at? If you want to challenge me, you have to bring cookies. I want cookies. Give me cookies. Give me see ya. Okay. Much better if we race all together. Yep. Probably would. Hey, Yoshi. I think you think you can beat old Boshi today? Uh, yeah, of course, man. He ain't got no chance. He gives us some cookies. Yummy. Yoshi got some cookies. Yum yum. Boshi only races on one on one, so everyone can't join us. Bummer. All right. And Boshi here is the fastest runner, but he's but he's full of himself. Well, let's just teach him a lesson then, huh? So you brought the cookies, all right? All right. Consider yourself lucky today. You got yourself a race, one on one. And this mini game is actually rather difficult. I've never actually beaten it myself. I don't know. Maybe it can be done. Post a video response if you can do this. Just saying. Hello again. Ready for what? Re get ready. The mushroom derby is coming up. Want instructions? Uh, sure. Why not? Press A and B alternately with, al along with the rhythm. The tighter the rhythm, the faster you go. Press the Y button during a race to eat a cookie. Its energy will help you go faster. Move faster, Yoshi. Want instructions again? Uh, no, I'm fine. Okay, so keep alternating between A and B. The beat. Whoa, this is weird. Interesting. Okay, can, can we get done with this, please? You still have some problems. Come on, concentrate. Practice some more. Sure, I'll practice one more time. Not it's not helping that I can't actually hear the beat of the music. Two, three. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Work it, honey, work it. Yeah, yeah. Let's go, Yoshi, go. Come on, baby, you ain't got no alibi. You ugly. Uh uh, you ugly. Okay, I kind of I kind of still suck at this. No, I don't want to practice again, but I'll I'll just race now. Okay, here we go, Boshi. This is as easy as it gets, man. I'm gonna turn up my TV a little bit, maybe. Yeah. Now I can hear it a bit better. What the heck? Okay, okay throw, the co co throw the cookie. Run, Yoshi! Run! Just use the cookies. Okay, well, that was annoying. I did better than I usually do, but it still sucked. I lost completely. Oh no. Well, that was sad. That was a sad way to end this video, wasn't it? Looks like I need a little more practice. Oh well, let's try again sometime. Uh, yeah, sure. Maybe a bonus episode. Maybe one day I'll beat Boshi. Screw you, buddy. Mm. If I could ground pound, I would. Right on your head. Alright. So, I think that's going to be it for this video. Looks like we're about 14 and a half minutes. Uh, let's move up from Yoster Isle. And in the next episode, we will go to Moleville, I guess. Yep, looks like that's the next location. Alright, thank you everyone for watching. Until next time, this is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you, and good night.